campaign office came alive 14 months after the formation of the Tinubu's presidency. But three days into the nationwide protest, these groups believed the presidential broadcast answered too many questions and put issues in the right perspective. I want to commend uh, the president of, the, of our great country, uh, President Bola Ahmed Tinubu, for what he has, for the giant strike that he has achieved in the last 13 months, and again to call on our youth to please give peace a chance uh, to allow the, the presidency uh, to properly settle down and address some of the challenges that our youth are agitating for. There is no public outing that Asiwaju has done that he has not identified, acknowledged the suffering of the people. Rationalizing some of the highlights from the president's speech, speakers said removal of fear subsidy and other critical reforms were difficult decisions the government has to take, but with a long-term impact. That first subsidy has to go. But again, uh, Mr. President has introduced uh, more innovation into, into the fuel uh, subsidy crisis. He has just spoken our mind. And that um, we understand there must be hardship. And during the campaign of Ashwaju, he told us there will be hardship, no doubt. And that is a sacrifice to pay for the change we are expecting in the nation. The groups, however, appealed to youth occupying major streets in the country to vacate and embrace dialogue for the parties concerned to broker truce and pursue a national agenda for all.